just trying to sort of put a bit of culture back in the music, as in like, uh, you know, having it in your hand, looking at it, that sort of thing, rather than just being everything digital all the time. Yeah. Because if everything's digital all the time, you've not really got anything, all you've got is a file, you know. And that's what it boils down to. You can't keep and you can't really cherish a file, can you? You know, I've just tried to recreate a sort of a Brit pop, you know, true to Britain feel of what it was like, you know. When you did walk in a shop and you had the records, you had the posters on the walls, you know, you've got, I mean, even right down to the boxes that we put them in, my husband made the whole, um, you know, specifically for that purpose. So it's a lot of heart and soul gone into the shop, really. So not only do I do the, the records, I do the clothes associated with the music. So if you know if you've got like Susan the Banshees sort of punk associated, then you're getting people in and they say, have you got any punk patches? Have you got any um, punk shoes? Have you got punk jackets? So that is helping to, to continue the business really. You know, people didn't have a lot of money years ago, so you know, people did used to buy like second-hand vinyl. They would go into the, the shop around the corner even there uh, once. You know, they've been going for years. I used to buy my vinyl in there when they used to do it years ago, and I used to live in a flat when I was a teenager across the road. So I'd come down with a few quid, buy a few second-hand vinyl. So you know, it's really sort of what people are doing now is really reliving what we've done before. So, you know, it's heartwarming to see that as well. It's heartwarming to see people, you know, young people doing the same sort of things that we've done with a, with a different little twist on it, you know. And that's what I'm trying to provide to people, really. I'm trying to get people to come down this end of town because obviously, you know, when you've got a really quiet end of town like it is down here, you know, you're constantly thinking, oh, you know, please come down because you're going to miss out. If, it, if we have to shut one day, you'll miss out on it because I'm trying to recreate what we had before, you know. So hopefully people will support us. <laughs>